Hi, I'm Nick Pierce, the Barefoot Prepper here at the Zombie Outpost and uh, also from Are You Ready Radio. I want to talk to you about a very important piece of uh, medical equipment that I keep in my medical kit, and that is this one-handed tourniquet. You've probably seen these on the shelf, especially if you're watching this video, and I just want to show you a little bit about it. First of all, it works kind of like a seatbelt works. It's got a little tab that locks in there, and I keep it in my metal kit, fully extended with the hoop as large as it gets, ready to go. When and if you need it, hopefully you never do, but if you do, they're very simple to use. Instead of having to try to tie a knot or um, uh, try to make a tourniquet out of something and, and it's not working because you only have one hand, supposedly an injury may have happened on your arm um, or something may have happened to your hand, uh, the one-handed tourniquet is a great option to stop the bleeding. Now, to release it, it's very simple. Just push the button and it comes right off. It also um, has this white portion on it. You can, if you have a Sharpie, write the time that you put it on. Because remember, using a tourniquet, you have to watch the time and how long it's been on there. So, another great, useful piece of equipment that we have. And I uh, hope that you never need it. But when you do need it, you have it. So, the one-handed tourniquet. Check out more links. Follow us on social media. Again, I'm Nick Pierce, the Barefoot Prepper here at the Zombie Outpost. And uh, scan some more of those codes look at some other great content. Thanks for tuning in to Off the Shelf.